What's up guys, Groovy Guitar Dude here. Today we're gonna be learning how to make a homemade capo. All you're gonna need to make your very own homemade capo is a plain pencil and a couple of hair ties or rubber bands. The first thing you wanna do is break your pencil in half. It doesn't matter too much which side of your pencil you use, just use the side that fits your fretboard best. Now we're to the point where we wanna grab our guitar. The first step is we're gonna get our pencil half, whichever half you choose to use, and we're gonna decide one side's gonna be the top and one side's gonna be the bottom. I'm gonna use this little black side as the bottom for me. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put my uh, hair tie on there. I'm gonna twist it around. And I'm gonna loop it back around. So what that does is it adds a little extra loop there. So it's gonna make this a little bit tighter whenever I actually put it on the guitar. Now we're gonna place it on whatever fret we wanna put it on. I'm just, I'm just using third fret. And we're gonna bring our hair tie behind the neck and up and over. And also what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the same thing we did on that side and we're gonna spin it to make an extra loop on top as well. Now it's gonna vary depending on what kind of rubber bands you use and how thick they are and how long they are and what kind of pencil you're using, but you're gonna to have to use a couple of rubber bands to get the right tension because right now everything's all muted and weird sounding and um, kind of fuzzy sounding and stuff. So I'm gonna add one more hair tie. I'll probably speed this part up because I'm just doing the same exact thing. I'm just adding an extra one to give a little bit more tension. All right, and the very last step is that you wanna make sure and slide this up as high up on the fret as you can get. So as, as close to the fret as you can get without being right up on it. And there you guys have it. That's your homemade capo right there for probably under a dollar, definitely under a dollar. Just to prove that it works, here's a little demo. Now guys, this is a great short-term solution if maybe your capo broke, or maybe you're in a bind and you forgot yours, or maybe you're just starting out guitar, you don't wanna spend the money on one yet, but it is not a great long-term solution. It's really time-consuming to put on, and it's also not very good for your strings or your guitar. Standard capos that you buy from Guitar Center or Musician's Friend or even on Amazon are not that expensive and can be bought for anywhere around the 20, 10 to $20 range. I'll link two of my favorite capos down in the description below so that you guys can check them out. I think one is about $10 and one is about $20. Thanks so much for checking out this video, guys. As always, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. And if you like this video, if it helped you out, please hit that subscribe button and I'll see y'all very soon. Thanks.